So hello guys. So today I'm about to show you my uh, maximum torque range with breaker bar. Tadaan! So I bought it at Canadian Tire for um, $89. So its original price is like $200. And seventy nine dollars. So I bought it because it has a complete <coughs> set with torque wrench, with breaker bar, and with some um, sockets for your wheel. So let's open it and see what's in the box. What we have here is this torque wrench with um, 50 to, 100 to 250 foot pound torque wrench and it has some, uh, what do you call this, instructions and it has a 24 inches breaker bar and an extension and it has a 7 and 8 7 and 8 deep, deep sockets 3 and quarter deep sockets and 13 and 16 inches deep socket. These are SAE. And we have here is the metric, the seven, 17 metric, in metric, 17 millimeter. Guys, I have one tip for you on this torque wrench. Before you guys store this torque wrench in a storage room make sure to put it back on to zero the settings put it back on the zero because if you don't put it back the spring inside will wear out okay so make sure to put this thing back to zero the the setting so that's the only tip that i can give you for this torque wrench so now we will try our breaker bar and our Torque wrench. Now we will try our breaker bar. So I'm gonna use the 21 millimeter. So I think it's good, it's working good, pretty good. I can break the nuts easily. So now we're going to try this torque. So I'm gonna torque my, um, I'm gonna torque my wheel onto a 75 foot pounds. 
So let's try it out how this torque wrench works. So there's the plate. There's the plate. There's the plate. There's the plate. So I think this torque wrench works pretty good and I like it so much. So that's how you do it. Okay? If you like this video, please like the uh, 